Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Crafting with V. If you're new here, welcome. So glad to have you. And if you're returning, thank you so much for returning. Okay, so I will let you know that right now I am using a binder for mine and I just started this binder. I've actually been doing a weekly planner the last few weeks. So, I went ahead. I have put away most of my other books. And I've been using this. And I just take the stuff out. And as the month goes by. Or the previous month. Um, and once a month is finished, I'll just put them in one of these little plastic three-prong folders and put it away. These are really cheap right now because they're on the back-to-school stuff. Um, but I already had this one. I have like ten of these, so I've got plenty for a little while. Try to put this back underneath here because I've got a mess over here. <clears throat> anyway, Beth at Beth's Bookish Reviews asked me to do a planner video. And this is what I'm doing right now. Um, Hold on one moment. Let me pause this a second. Okay, so I went and this is why I haven't been working on this way. I've got a binder like this, except it's Happy Planner. And I have not bought a new Happy Planner that wasn't on clearance in quite a while. But I don't waste them. And the reason that I say that, if I wanted to with these sheets, I would go ahead and trim the end off right here. And I would put them in my binder. I do have a happy, happy planner hole punch though. Whenever I used to use strictly happy planner stuff. But anyway, this is part of the weekly that I'm going to show you what I did. Um, so a lot of this I didn't get to decorate. It's got very minimal decorations on it. and. Mine do not always match, okay? Um, I decorate it the way I want it. Most of the time, I'm the only one that's going to see it, so it's fine. But this is from the 27th through the 30th. I'm going to bring this up here a little bit. You can kind of see the whiteout. These were from planner pages from 2022. I just changed the date on the top. And at the time, I couldn't find my little stickers. So that's what I did. I've got my to-do list here on some of them. Remember, I've always got a to-do list on each one of these. Um, I put in here when Josh and Courtney both work. And the reason I do that is because... Whenever they're working and stuff, the kids are at my house. So somebody has to be here to watch them. I always put my coffee chat and whip live. And this is just a little sticker. Now, this weekly planner works out great for just keeping up with things. Like you've got little to-do lists and stuff like that. Works out great. And what is it? They might be having clearance sales on planners right now. And most of the time around this time of year, if you get the ones that start in January, a lot of times I would get them at least 75% off, 90% off, and you can change the dates on them. If you just want to use a plain planner like that, you can just change the dates, which is what I do normally if I use the pre-planner kind. And then <coughs> if you will notice in these that I love owls. <coughs> Excuse me. 
excuse me. Okay, so I've got Courtney's schedule in here. I've got my to-do list. This was actually on a Monday, and you'll notice that my Monday, my Saturday, Sunday, Mondays are normally kind of slow. <coughs> I may have to pause this in a minute and go get a drink, but anyway, my Mondays normally aren't decorated that much, but I've got when Courtney works. And then on the third, we had the camping reservations at South Park. So that was whenever we took the camper over there. And then it says Courtney worked CB 8 to 2. She was working two jobs, so I had to mark whenever she worked her second job, but she's no longer working there. And I put in here order keychain. So I made that order and then something happened and it didn't go through. So I didn't actually order those keychains. Um, on July 4th, we had our cookout and fireworks over at my mother-in-law's house. And then that night, Lexi and, Mo stayed, Lexi and Mo and Robbie stayed at the campground in our camper. But I just, these are just little things that I do for my weekly one. As you can see on this page, it's kind of bland. You do not see much on either of these page, pages because I really didn't have time to do a whole lot of planning on these days. And that's just how it is. Sometimes this is the way my planner looks. But this is the weekly ones. Um, you can do it that way. And there's not a problem with that. You can cut the edges off of those. Or you can get a spiral one. Use it however you want to do it. You can use that for the whole year and change the dates on it. Okay, so we are going to go to this part of the planner. Whenever I do it like a daily planner, I like to have my months in little sections. And I like to have tabs so I can go directly to the day that I'm talking about. Okay, this first page here and... This one is not, I'm surprised it's not because I had it in a regular folder. But a lot of times I will keep a sheet of paper in my purse, whatever. And I'll put post-it notes on it. It'll be folded up because I'm taking it everywhere with me. If not one of these, then I might have a little notebook that I keep with me. Just something that I can keep notes on so that I can put it in, in my planner at a later time. Okay, so this, and I know that, and I'm going to go through how to make one of these pages here in just a minute. This right here is just an example of one of my pages. And the good thing is, with these, is you can take them out of the thing. So, up here at the top, you see, can you see that? I know my lighting in here is not that great right now. But I have the date up here at the top. Now, I do have some stickers for the Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, but once again... I'm so unorganized today that I couldn't find them. And then on Wednesdays, we, greet, we go grocery shopping every week. So you'll probably see something like this, let's go shopping or with a list or something like that on every one of my Wednesday ones. 
Then over here, this is like my to-do list, even though I didn't put to-do. Um, sort of, because it's not so much a to-do list. Got my grocery shopping on there. DoorDash 10 to 10. And I don't just stay in town that whole time. I do come back home. And I will... <clears throat> Actually, that should have been 12 to 10. Because on Wednesdays, I don't schedule it till 12. But... And then I've got to watch the kids. Because Courtney works 11 to 5. And then for dinner that night, we're having, we had breakfast burritos, which this was last night. And so I've got all of my stuff right here. And then, y'all know, I absolutely love owls, so I've got a lot of owl stickers. And these ones in particular, they sell at the Dollar Tree. So every time I run out of them. I go and get more. And then my other little square down here just says YouTube happenings. And then I put on there because I wanted to make a planner video. And I definitely want to do, I, want, I wanted to do this yesterday. As you can see, it didn't get done yesterday. It got done today. But my planner video <coughs> and coffee chatting with 85. And then over here, I just, I like to jot down just little things about my YouTube channel. If something happens on it, if I have an achievement, or in this case, just how many subs I have. Which, I've got 616 subs. Um, and this helps me keep track with if it goes down, if it goes up. All that. And then I always try to put just a little sticker on here. Like this one says dream big. And I broke down and ordered Timu. I just made a little note of that down there. So that's the first one. Okay for today. <laughs> I have pretty much got this. Um wrote down and wrote out and just so you know on this month I was wanting to use my pink paper I, I know the first one I show you is yellow but my yellow and pink paper but once again I'm so unorganized today I could not find it to finish up the monthly stuff so, I'm going to use some of this stuff that I got from the Dollar Tree, and it's just been sitting over there. I have used some of these cutouts. They have the little thing that you open. But I am going to use some of these and some of the other ones, but we'll get to that. Okay, so right here is the 18th. What? Come on. I've got my little tab right here. And how I make these little tabs, and they're really easy to make. In fact, where is something that we can do an example on? Okay, I'm just going to use this right here. It can be something as easy as taking one of these file folder, these file folder things, make it as long or as short as you want it. If you want it shorter than that, you cut it. As soon as I find my scissors. So, say you want it that short. You cut it. And then you just put it on the side about halfway through. Take another sticker or whatever of the same size and line it up. Let me see if I can 
Hold on just a second. I'm going to try to zoom this in just a little bit. I wish my light over here was just a little bit better. Let's try moving this over here a little bit closer. Maybe that'll help some. Okay. So... I'm going to try to zoom this in right now just a little bit so that you can see. Put this sticker on this one side. And then you just take the same size sticker and line it up and put it on the other side. And if you happen to get it not so lined up, just trim it off a little bit. And then you've got your little tab on your page. That's how I make most of my tabs on mine. These right here are made from just little pieces of cardstock that were scraps that I trimmed up. See, like these right here. I just put them on there. Oh, here's the one that I trimmed it up. But anyway, okay, let's zoom it not in, back out. But Anyway, where was I at? <clears throat> okay, so on this, that is a little bit better. You can see it a little bit better. Got my little tab up here. I decided that this one I was going to decorate in little doggies. Today, my to-do list, I've got the little bone that says to do laundry. Take Josh and Courtney to work and watch the kids. Of course, I've got other stuff that I need to do today. The only thing that I can think of that I need to buy today is onions from the store for the tacos tonight. And then later today, I'll put how many subs I have right here, which I can go ahead and do that. I haven't, I believe it's still six 16. So I'm going to go ahead and write that in there. And then I've got to answer my comments today. Since I want to do a coffee chat and whip that will be done in that along with answering them on screen as well. I like to do both. <coughs> And then today is going to be a busy day for me because I've got to take Courtney to work, take Joshua to work, watch the kids. And then I just put a little note down here saying, be sure to plug in my car in the AM because I didn't want to, it didn't need a full night of charging because I still had over 100 miles left on it. So I went ahead and plugged it in. This morning, whenever I got up, I'll have to check that here in just a little bit so that I can make sure it doesn't get charged up too much. And then my goal of the day today is to drink more water. I really need to drink more water. Okay, so if I think of something else I need, then I'll go ahead and put it right here. On Saturday, as you can see, we have a blank page with just a tab on it telling me the date. So, Saturday, let's see. And I will tell you that I normally have my little tape runner. But once again, all my stuff decided to disappear. So, I think I'm going to put a couple of these on here. 
And you'll notice on the weekends, I tend to use the bigger things for mine. <clears throat> because I normally do not have as much stuff going on. On the weekends. Okay, so what I'm going to do with these is... Normally, I would tape these down a lot better than this, but I want to be able to write on these, and I don't want to take up much writing room because it's going to be a little bit hard to write on the tape. So, trying to use as little as I can. That's why I use a tape runner all the time in my planners and journals and I know it's around here somewhere but I wanted to get this video done I couldn't find all the stuff last night to do this video so <coughs> didn't so much get it done okay now let's tape this one on here Kind of put that right there so it's kind of double taped in the same spot. Okay. Okay, so on this one, I do not have a date one. So, let's see. You know what? We got flowers. <clears throat> so, I'm going to try to use this one. And, yes, I did get this Happy Planner book from um, Walmart. But I did get it on clearance. I got all of my sticker things on clearance. Okay. Just <clears throat> for the date... I think I'm going to put Rapunzel up here in the corner. Can you see that? I hope you can. And <clears throat> let's use this. I know it does not match. This is going to be Saturday, I believe. Let me double check. I think that's where we left off, as you can see. Um, and once you start making these, they are not hard. They don't take any time, but since I'm trying to show what I'm doing, it is taking me a little bit longer. And ignore my handwriting because it is terrible at times. Saturday, and then we're going to put July 20th, which I really don't have to do that. I can just put the Saturday up there because. I have the 20th right here, but I do it anyway. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to use this. I'm going to use Rapunzel on all these. So let's see. I think I'm going to use this purple right here because it's a lighter purple and I'm just going to put it on this flower and this is for me so I'm just going to write V or no I'm not even going to write the V I'm just going to write work Twelve, 
to 11.30, which is the times that I work. Sometimes it's earlier, sometimes later. But that's for me. Okay, so let's see. What else are we going to do on this top one? This top one I'm going to use for my list and stuff. And let's see. Even though I don't have to take Courtney to work. Hey, Saturday. We are going to put Courtney on there as well. Let's use the little froggy. And I know that this may not look the best for a lot of y'all, but that's okay. This, sometimes my pages turn out really good, and sometimes they do not. And this one, I think, is going to be one of those that's not the greatest, but it happens. Okay, so... <clears throat> Right here, and I changed to a pencil because my handwriting is a lot better in pencil than it is in pen. And I'm going to write Courtney works. I think it was 11 to 4, which my son will watch the kids that day. I just said it to 10 to 4. Okay, and then let's see. And Joshua does not work. And then down here is going to be my YouTube stuff. And then over here will just be a place to put a sticker or whatever I want to do with that. But I'm going to put a little... Let me see if I can find something on here. Those are all Jasmine. And Belle. I thought there was some other types of stickers in here. And there probably was, and I used them. <laughs> Let's see. So, we are going to use... I think we're going to use this one because it kind of matches the purple. Okay. And this is going to be where I put down my... I'm going to use this pen. I'm going to put my Saturday... Coffee, chat, and whip love. And then I think what I'm going to do around the sides of this is just right. I have my white Papermate pen. It's a bright pen. I'm going to write over here subs. If it'll show up. Yep. 
in a way, whenever I bought these pens, I bought them as to kind of use as white out, but they don't work as well for that. So, and then I'm going to put visit with friends. Fun. <laughs> Chat. And what should this other one be? I think I'm going to leave it blank for right now, but be sure to give me a suggestion on what I should put on that other petal. Y'all can barely see that in there. Let's see if I might change that and write over it with a different color. But, okay. So I've got subs on that one, visit with friends, fun, and chat. But up here, I still need to do my to-do list. And for the most part, my to-do list on those days is going to be is going to be um, work related. So let's see. I do have a lot of happy planner stuff. I think. Not that one. I'm just going to show these to you because I use these three stencils all the time okay this one has is like a little calendar then i've got my list ones the little arrows that you saw in one of my other ones but i use these stencils all the time and once again i got these on clearance at Hobby Lobby at some point. Okay, so I'm going to put my to-do list right here. I'm going to add some red just because I want the color in there. But these stencils are always being used. <clears throat> and then I'm going to write to do up here. And then I'm going to switch pens just because I like to do stuff in different colors. Okay, so at work, I have to... These are just basically the end of the night things that I have to have done before I go home. So I have to do my logging. Have to do my logs, which is two different things. I have to log stuff and then I have to make the logs for the next day. Have to do my tahas, which are basically just papers that we attach to the bills that show how high they need to be stacked, how much, <clears throat> and how many cases we get in for the receivers and the unloaders so they know how to break them down on the pallets. And then I have a report that I have to do at the end of the night. And then if there are other things that come up, I can put them on those last few sections right there. I don't always fill out all of my spots for my all of that. So, let's see. That's my to-do list. Still need something over here. It's miss since I don't have much going on on Saturdays. 
I could put I'm a Grinch before coffee, but that's more of a Christmas one. Let's see. <clears throat> I thought I had some bigger stickers of Rapunzel, but I don't. How about this one? This one looks kind of cute. You can do this, and it kind of matches. So we'll go ahead and put that in there. It's just a space taker for that. Like I said, this is not one of my favorite ones that I've done, but it's just for me, so... Caffeine? Nah. I might have to go with one of my other character stickers. How about this rose right there? Maybe that's what we can do for that page. Or that spot. Put that right there. How does that look? Kind of want to put something else down here, but I'm not sure what. I'll probably put notes right there. Okay. So let's go ahead and put this right here. my other flower and that kind of gives that a better look right there and then I think what we're going to put over here is just a little note section so that if anything happens I'll have a place to put it and then up here I have a place as well so we are going to use one of these bigger ones Right here, I'm going to put it right up against that red line. I could probably take this out and make this a lot easier. Then this one I'm going to put on the outside of that red line. I'll give a place for like three little notes. Okay. And I kind of want to color those in. Oops. So I have my pens here. Try to use this purple gel pen to kind of color it in. I'm not the world's best colorer, so... But I do use my gel pens a lot to color stuff in. In fact, I used to color all the time with my gel pens instead of markers. I don't know why, because I went through the ink twice as fast, but I loved them. I will have the next one of these that I do a little better planned out. So this down here is just going to be notes, kind of. And if I had my phone here, I would show you something. But like I said, I'm not very organized today. As you can see, that came down. Okay. So I'm just going to write up here, notes. I know that's kind of ugly, but that's okay. This is just your thing. Okay, let's see. But I will say the G2 pens make a much better coloring ones than those other ones that I have. But I just don't have all the colors that I do. In my G2 pens. Not with me anyway. That looks like a kindergartner colored that tea. 
as you can see, that's all messy. Let's see if I have anything here. And whenever you have something like this, it doesn't have to say notes for your notes. As long as you know what it's for, that's fine. Like we can put this sticker. Nope, that won't even cover it up. You'll hear me say this a lot on my channel. Um, if you don't like it, put a sticker on it. And whenever I say that, it it pertains to a lot more than just planning. If you don't like it, put a sticker on it. Change it. Change your it into something that you like. Like, I know that this is not the best page. But I kind of want to put this little purple Care Bear on here. I want to change it a little bit. Even though I've got Aurora, I'm going to put this little purple Care Bear because I messed up on that. I want to change it into something that I like. And that goes for much more than just planning. If you don't like something, put a sticker on it. Make it into something that you like. Say it's a shelf that you don't like, put some paint on it. Make it into something that you like. Make the changes that you need to make to make it better for you. And that's basically what I mean whenever I'm saying that. Not just towards crafts, but your everyday life. Change it into something that you like. <laughs> But it's one of my favorite sayings. I have no idea where I heard it from. But I love that. Okay, so this has the 20th. And we are already at 51 minutes. So I might have to cut this down just a little bit. But all in all, that one didn't turn out too bad. It's not my favorite, but it's not the worst that I've done. I really like this one. This is one of my favorite ones that I've done. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to do one more, and I'm going to try to speed through it a little bit. Okay, so this one is Sunday. I don't have any Sunday stickers with me, I don't think. Let me look at this bottom one. <laughs> you know, this one is not going to do me much good. I could mark that out and not charge on there now that I don't have to put gas in my car. This is a budget one, so it probably will not have what I need in it. No. Let's see. We're going to, like I said, we're going to try to make this one quick. But, here. I think I want to use this sticker that says plan all things. And some of these, it's hard to get the sticker straight. So if I'm using lined paper, I try to line it up with the two lines. But sometimes that does not always work. Okay. <clears throat> so... This is a celebration one, so we don't need most of these stickers in here. But. I kind of like. 
these little things like this. So we're going to put this right here across the top of the page. <clears throat> and see, this is what I do. I just pick out something and do it. I don't really make a whole lot of plans to my planner pages. And that one's kind of off a little bit, but that's okay. I know it might drive some of y'all crazy, but... Okay, so on this one, even though it's not a planning one, or down here, I'm going to put my YouTube stuff, kind of. I'm going to put subs on this one. And then we are going to this right here for what can we put it for? Okay, I'm going to try to answer all my comments, maybe record a whipping chat. Or how about on Sunday I do a driving chat? Which will go on to one of my other things that I'm working on with a little picture of the drive. Driving chat. Okay, and don't really have a whole lot of things on weekends to put on here for YouTube because I just don't have a whole lot of time to do the YouTube. I'm going to take that off a little bit and oops re-stick it because that's even driving me crazy. There we go. I think that looks a little bit better. Okay and then Plan all things. This is going to be my to-do list. So I'm going to write. This is going to be the same thing over and over on this. So it's logging. Logs. Tahas. And there's much more to my job than this. This is just the stuff that I have to do before I go home. And report. <coughs> okay, and then, okay, and right here, I'm going to put notes. And I'm just going to write it on the outside right there. And down here. And then I think I want to put some kind of little decorative stickers. Because like I said. There's not a whole lot... of stuff that I have going on on the weekends. I think I'm going to put this here because YouTube is something that I love to do. So I'm going to put this down here. Do what you love. Y'all can't see that very well, but just a little sticker right there. Let's see, I've got plenty of unicorn stickers. Got my coffee stickers. I 
I want to use this so bad, but I can't find anything that it works well with yet. I will, though. See if I can find any of my other sticker box. I got my little honeybees. I love this little sticker. And Beth, I think you'll really like this one. It says, there's always a home to be found inside a book. And it's got a little dragon there. Love that one. We could put this cute little raccoon there. Let's see. I know I've got other stickers that would work well. Pull out some of these. Okay. I'll put these back in there later, maybe. I have this, which says, today may be hard, but tomorrow will come, and you never have to do today again. Got my little Stardust sticker. I call those my Stardust stickers. And then these are just little bottles with nature scenes, cityscapes, whatever in them. Let's see. Train. Okay. So we got this one down here that's sort of a plain. I think I'm going to put this here and then this is going to be my notes section for the day. But I may add just this cute little raccoon down here. And over here, I'm going to put another one of these that says YouTube on it. Or maybe a big one. Kind of. And this will show that it's my YouTube stuff down here. YouTube happenings. Okay. Let's put the little sticker right here for the cute little raccoon. And I love the fact that the eyes match this and that. And then we're going to put this up here that says, don't forget the happy thoughts. In my notes for the day. And sometimes I just use that spot to journal in. And then I need one more thing. Okay. Let's get these put away. And this will be the last one that we do today. I'll go through here. And I'll try to finish this this weekend. And then I will show you the pages, maybe in a whip and chat, or just take time to do a planner walkthrough. <clears throat> I'm 
but I need something up here to put. I think I know what I'm going to use too. Saw it earlier. And now I don't see them. Okay, I know it's here. It was just some banner things so that I can put the day on it. These. We are going to do pink, of course. And I'm just going to write Monday. Or this is not Monday. So I need something. If you don't like it, put a sticker on it. We'll put a purple sticker on it. Cover that little mistake up. Okay, 21st. I'm going to write... July 21st, and then over here, I'm going to write Sunday. Okay. I think that does it for this page. Um. Sorry my weekends aren't that extravagant or that exciting, but it's what we do. I think I'm going to put, no, I've already got the notes there, but we'll do something like this right here. Okay, and then maybe the little dots through here. Oops, I moved it. Hopefully I didn't get it too far off. Okay. So, anyway, this is how this page turned out. I actually kind of like this page. I don't know about y'all, but I really kind of like this one. So, anyway, that's all I have for today. These are just my daily planner pages. We might take some of my pages from something like this later and do a weekly one. This is from 2022-2023, and it just has these, and then all you got to do is change that, and you can do this for every page or whatever, or you can cut these out and put them on a bigger page, however you want to do it, but anyway, I do have plenty of different types of weekly pages that I can put in here. But anyway, that's all I have for today. I will see everyone next time. If you liked this video, let me know. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, comment. Let me know if you would like more of these. Anyway, I will see you next time. Everyone take care. Bye.